So we started off with a <coughs> cottage garden and we found it was too much to look after, too much watering. And so we, uh, we come from the land, we had a three acres of native garden on the property. So we decided to go back to natives, something that we knew about. But it's been a fair bit of work over the last six years to get it up and going. It's probably... Um... We choose native plants that flower predominantly all year and it attracts the bird life, the butterflies, and it is very rewarding to hear the birds in the garden all day. Once established, they do not need a lot of water. They're very hardy, and you choose the plants that suit your soil. Uh, we've got quite a few rare and endangered plants here and to see them flower, but it's just to sit back and look at your garden, enjoy it, and it's there for other people to come and enjoy too, yeah? Once we were accepted to have our garden in the competition, we found it very rewarding because you meet so many other gardeners and it raises money for charities. Uh, we pick our own charity and we sell um, tea and coffee and sewing and Adrian makes structures out of recycled metal and all <coughs> proceeds go to Life Flight.